Welcome everyone to this flax linen tutorial from the Alliance for European Flax Linen and Hemp on invoices for European flax products. Why make a tutorial on invoices? Well, for three main reasons. European flax is a certification of origin and traceability for flax fibers grown in Western Europe. Invoices are at the center of the traceability system for European flax certified products, which relies on the chain of custody principle. Invoices are also a decisive element of verification during yearly audits by Bureau Veritas. And finally, they are key to brands labeling products with the European flax trademark. So it's important to get them right. What does the chain of custody principle mean at the company or brand level? It means all the companies in the supply chain of a certified product must be European flax certified until the last business to business transaction, the last transaction before the final consumer. That includes all types of processors from scutchers until garment manufacturers, but also traders that do not perform any transformation and even, in some cases, brands. And what does that mean at the product level? Well, once they are certified, companies can produce both certified products and non-certified products. Products are certified when they are made from 100% European flax certified flax linen supplies and no other kind of flax linen and they are made of at least 50% of flax linen. Non-certified products typically will not meet these criteria. So, to specifically trace certified materials and products moving from certified company to certified company, European Flax uses their sales invoices as a means to keep track. What must feature on an invoice for European Flax certified products to ensure traceability, certification of the products and smooth audits? European Flax requires only three elements, but all three must always be visible and correct. First, the selling company's certificate number. It can be placed freely on the invoices, but it must be there to show the selling company is indeed certified. Second, the fiber composition of each item. Respecting the composition requirements is essential for products to be European flax certified, so make sure it's there. Third, the claim European flax certified for each item. Just like in the example here, an invoice can include both certified products and non-certified products. So make sure to include this exact claim with each certified item. The claim cannot be translated or changed. It is in English with the correct trademark name European Flax and its characteristic TM in index, European Flax Certified. See, it's actually quite simple. To brands and certified companies buying certified materials, these are the three elements you must verify on your invoices upon delivery. An incorrect invoice means the products or materials you purchased cannot be certified or labeled. To companies editing their invoices, as shown here, make sure to include all three elements. Note that if all the items on the invoice are certified, it is possible to state the following sentence just once. All the products listed in this invoice are European flax certified. But the company's certificate number and the product composition must still be included 